and stories of a cat in a hat and maybe a fish named Dory. People would read to me all day, say, hey, little Nikki, come out to play. There was an expectation to read, read, read. That was the recipe to succeed, seed, seed. But I was consumed in what I thought I need. TV, movies, and screen, screen, screens. But then my life, it took a shift. Parents got divorced, they left me adrift. Since the business revolved around the summer, I consequently my time with them suffered. But do not take pity, it was the best time of my life. Living with my grandparents, no more strife. All life, this is what we do. Nikki J, yo, me to you. Check it. Let me tell you about my living history. It all started at the tender age of three. My Grammy would sit and read to me. Now I'm here singing for the whole world to see. Let me tell you about my thirsty history. It all started at the tender age of three. My Grammy would three. sit and read to me. Now, these said grandparents are pretty damn cool. Always there for me even when I'm a fool. They gave me important skills that I still use today. Like how to find a good book and how to save a buck. Yeah, buck. More importantly, my Grammy gave me drive just to be me. She came from the home country, Italy, living in the most extreme poverty. See Nick books all the way out. I went from dirt floors to a family big house. In two college degrees, a life dedicated to others. Put your mind to anything and you will discover. So that's what I did. She opened my eyes and read books about planes in the big skies and scary guys. But good always wins. Reading books can never be a sin. Six, I was on the chapter books. Magic Treehouse was uh, all the looks. Reading about different places near and far Yo, it really sucked because I couldn't even drive a car As the years continued, things started getting in the way Homework, sports, and the occasional lay day Reading was pushed further and further away But then a shift came in my school day Let me tell you about my literacy history It all started at the tender age of three My Grammy would sit and read to me Now I'm here singing for the whole world to see Let me tell you about my literacy history It all started at the tender age of three My Grammy would sit and read to me I switched to private school Private rules A whole new way of thinking I started getting forced to read not for the sport of it Look behind the words and you might even enjoy a bit I love being in the environment I was I could speak freely and express my grudge against the system That be killing our souls, we need a government change And that is for sure I went from getting a hard B Scoring a 32 on my ACT And then I started a band This made me readjust my writing hand to write music that means something to me Music with a message for people to see I love reggae, could listen all day So when writing music, I had to push stereotypes away It's not about weed or getting high The music can the message to the most high Ja, Rastafari Even though I'm an atheist, it was no lie I can still sing in the style that I like Trying to stop the hate through this mic we went from playing in front of 20 to 5,000 deep representing my city All looking at me as I sing Dancing around to the music that we bring Now, here I am Sitting in a classroom in the Midwestern jam Having to reflect on it end up being pretty fun Isn't it ironic I got graded on what I've done? On what I've done? My life, the story. Let me tell you about my literacy history. It all started at the tender age of three. My Grammy would sit and read to me. Now I'm here singing for the whole world to see.